This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com. So the Pasuk says, Paro says, you will no longer provide straw for the people. Not only will, will the people have to build their own bricks, but they'll have to gather their straw as well. Let's make note of the fact that the word lois soy sifun, which typically would be spelled taf, vav, samach, yud, pei, vav, nun, is spelled here with an aleph. Taf, aleph, samach, yud, pei, vav, nun. The Admir of Sachachav observes that the status of the Jewish people in Mitzrayim was different than their status in any other time in the Gullahs. In every other Gullahs, the Jewish people are scattered throughout the land. There are nafots. They're Mefuzar and Not so in Mitzrayim. In Mitzrayim, the Jews were all together. And the reason, the reason behind this phenomenon is because in the other Goliaths, they were after the Torah was given. So after the Torah was given, we'd be able to survive even if we'd, we were scattered. Not so in Mitzrayim. In Mitzrayim, it was prior to the giving of the Torah, and therefore there would be no way for the Jewish people to have any survival had we not been gathered together. And when Pari looks at the Jewish people and he sees them concentrated, he realized this would be a thorn in his side. He realized that God orchestrated that the Jews should be gathered together to be able to survive. And therefore, Pari was so upset about this, Rav David Lelover points out, that's why Pari says, Loi soi sifun. They should not be gathered anymore. With an aleph. Not no longer like a lashon of soi sif, but Taf Aleph Samach Yud Pei Vav Nun, a language of Asaf. They can no longer be gathered together. This was not good in the eyes of Paroi. He realized that the concentration of the Jewish people in one area was Lura Asai. Now, after, when, uh, after this Gezeira, the Pasuk says, Vayafetz Ha'am. The people, in fact, did scatter. And the reason they were able to scatter is because. Once they were given the Besura and the news of the Geula, therefore they had, in their minds, it was as if they were redeemed already, and they had the wherewithal to be able to survive the Gaulists, despite the fact that they were nafot and scattered throughout the land. So they, this is a, the observation of the Admar of Sachachav, of the status of the Jewish people in the Gaulists. After the Torah was given, we do have the wherewithal to withstand uh, being spread all over, as opposed to in Mitzrayim. In Mitzrayim, before the Torah was given, we did not have that capacity. But once we were given word that we would be redeemed, that infused us with extra, an extra measure of stamina, and we were able to survive even the state of being scattered. Wishing everyone a beautiful Shabbos. You've just experienced another Torah class, brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.